Begin by settling in. Allow your body to be comfortable by choosing a position that feels good for you right now. And invite your body to relax, letting go of any muscular tension that might be present for you at this time. Enjoy this comfort and relaxation for a moment. If you'd like, if it feels good for you, bring a gentle, easy smile to your face. Take a moment to reflect on something in your life that you feel grateful for. Anything at all. In loving-kindness practice, you can cultivate an attitude of love for all beings, all humans and all animals. Everyone, every being, deserves the same kind of love that you give your easy-to-love person or animal, or that you would feel for yourself or a close friend or family member. We can practice seeing things this way and cultivating this attitude of love for all beings. Imagine different beings in your mind's eye. Imagine all of the humans, near and far. Visualize humanity in your mind's eye. And visualize all of humanity being happy. And visualize all of the animals, the dogs and the cats, Lions and tigers and elephants, giraffes and gorillas, pandas and zebras. All of the animals on the planet. And wish that those animals might be happy. And consider as well all of the plants, the trees and the bushes, the grasses and the flowers, the moss, all of the plants on this planet, and wish them well that they might be happy. You can even extend this attitude of love and care to the insects and the bacteria on the planet, knowing that they also play a vital role, wishing that they might be happy and live in harmony with us and the other beings on this planet.
If you'd like, as you cultivate this attitude of loving kindness, you can use a phrase like, may all beings be happy, or may everyone on the planet be happy. You don't necessarily have to visualize all beings at the same time. That might be very difficult. Most important thing is to cultivate an attitude of loving kindness that extends to all living beings, that's unconditional. And you can do that in any way that you like, with images or phrases in your mind. Continue to cultivate loving kindness for all beings. As you cultivate this attitude of loving kindness, notice what your emotional body feels like in your throat and your chest, your stomach. And if there's any felt sense of love or happiness or care, notice that and really enjoy it. Feel that love, feel that happiness. Ultimately, this felt sense of love and care is what loving kindness practice is aimed at. So if that's present for you, notice it and really enjoy it. By feeling that feeling of love and care in your body and enjoying it, savoring it, those feelings of love and happiness can grow and spread in your body. They might even extend outside of your body. Explore if that's possible for you at this time. Feeling the love in your body and letting it grow and spread. This love in your heart can be like a flashlight in a dark room, spreading out, extending outwards, illuminating everything, spreading love towards all living beings. Whatever your experience, continue to cultivate an attitude of loving kindness for all beings. Very good. Now, take a moment to look back on your experience. What was it like for you? Was it challenging? Was it enjoyable? Did you learn anything new? Consider what your experience was like. 